Number one says, use the diagram below to answer the following questions. We know this polygon is going to form a trapezoid and it's going to be known as a right angled trapezoid. Now the first part of this question says, state the pair of parallel lines. Now when you read this question, it is very important that you understand what the question is asking for. So it says, state the pair of parallel lines. These two words right here, parallel lines, are very important. You must understand and remember the definition of parallel lines. Now we know parallel lines are going to be lines that are the same distance apart and these lines will never intersect. When I say intersect, that means these two lines will never meet. Also, another key word to remember is going to be this word, pair. This word is very important. Now, when we talk about a pair, we're talking about two. So they want us to state the two parallel lines in this polygon. If we look at this, which two lines are going to be parallel? Exactly. We can see line PQ and line SR are going to be the pair of parallel lines. Therefore, we can just write this as PQ and SR. Now, you might be wondering, what about PS and QR? Well, we know these two lines are not parallel lines. First of all, because they're not the same distance apart. And second of all, if the line QR continues in this direction, I'm just going to draw it here. Then we know it's just a matter of time if this line PS also continues before they intersect, which means these two lines are not parallel lines. Now the second part of this question says, state a pair of perpendicular lines. So they want us to state a pair, which means two, of perpendicular lines. So it is very important that you understand and remember what are perpendicular lines. We know perpendicular lines are going to be lines that intersect and form a right angle which equals to 90 degrees. Now if we look at this polygon, we can see that there is already an angle marked with the 90 degree angle. We can see this right here is going to represent 90 degrees. And because that represented 90 degrees, we can say the line PS, also the line SR, is going to be the pair that makes up the perpendicular lines. Therefore, we can write this as line PS and line SR. Now there is also another pair of perpendicular lines in this polygon. And because this polygon is a right angled trapezoid, if this is 90 degrees, then this angle right here is also going to be 90 degrees. Therefore, another pair of perpendicular lines would have been line PQ and line PS. So if you wrote PS and SR, or if you decided to write PQ and PS, you're still going to get the answer correct. This is how we state the pair of parallel lines and perpendicular lines for a right angle trapezoid.